Welcome to Regrid's tutorial video series. Today we'll be doing a quick tour of the mobile version of the Regrid property app. To see information about a property, simply tap on it. You'll see its boundaries highlight on the map, and some info will come up on a card toward the bottom. You can swipe this card up to see all of the information that Regrid has about this property. And you can swipe down to close it again, and return to the full screen map. To move around the map, you can use the standard pinching gesture to zoom in and out, or tap and drag your finger to pan across the map. You can also use our search button to find a place or property of interest, and you can always tap the triangular locate me icon, which is found below the search icon, to be zoomed right to your current location. You'll also notice that up at the top center of the screen is the place name. You can tap this to see additional information about this place, and if you tap zoom to area, you can see the boundaries of the place you're looking at. If you see a property or a place that you're interested in, you can tap the follow button to follow this property. This will highlight it on the map and it will add it to your following list where you can always find it later. This is the middle button on the toolbar at the bottom right. To customize the map, tap the layers button on the bottom of the toolbar. This will bring up a menu where you can toggle on and off base maps like satellite and elevation contours, as well as overlay things on the map, such as, for example, owner names. Finally, tapping the pencil and ruler icon brings up our tools menu. Here you can measure distance, area, find the lat long coordinates of a place on the map, or draw a custom focus area for following purposes. That's it for our quick start video. Please watch some of our other tutorial videos that go more in depth about specific functions if you're curious. And don't forget that as a subscriber, you get access not only to the app, but also to our website, app.regrid.com, where you'll find additioning mapping tools better suited to larger screens.